Have you ever felt the thrill of a mystery, the allure of the unknown, the excitement of a riddle waiting to be solved? Welcome to our exploration of historical mysteries, where we'll uncover how modern science has shed light on puzzling phenomena. We'll delve into the mysteries of the Bermuda Triangle, the secrets behind Stonehenge, and the true purpose of the Pyramids of Egypt. So, pack your curiosity and your sense of adventure. Buckle up as we journey back in time to unravel these enigmas that have baffled us for centuries. Remember the Bermuda Triangle, that infamous patch of sea where ships and planes supposedly vanished without a trace? It's an enigma that has captivated the world for decades, a mystery wrapped in layers of speculation and folklore. From tales of extraterrestrial activity to lost civilizations and even time warps, the Bermuda Triangle has been the subject of countless theories. But let's strip away the layers of myth and delve into the realm of science. Modern research has taken a swing at these enigmas, and guess what? The Bermuda Triangle isn't as mysterious as we've been led to believe. Let's start with a basic fact. The Bermuda Triangle isn't officially recognized by the U.S. Board on Geographic Names. It's not an actual geographic location, so its boundaries, which supposedly stretch from Miami to Bermuda and then to Puerto Rico, are entirely arbitrary. Interesting, isn't it? Then, there's the issue of disappearances. Yes, ships and planes have vanished in this region, but the rate of these occurrences is no higher than anywhere else in the world's oceans. Surprised? You're not alone. The infamy of the Bermuda Triangle has been fueled by selective reporting and sensationalism rather than data-driven facts. Now, let's tackle the big theories. One popular explanation for these disappearances is the presence of massive rogue waves. These are unusually large and spontaneous ocean surface waves that occur in open water. These waves can reach heights of up to 100 feet, easily capable of overwhelming a ship or downing an aircraft. And guess what? Recent studies have shown that rogue waves are more likely to occur in the Bermuda Triangle than almost anywhere else. So, there you have it. The Bermuda Triangle, once a symbol of unexplained disappearances and eerie phenomena, has been demystified by the power of science. It's not about aliens, time portals, or lost civilizations, but about natural phenomena, like rogue waves and the selective reporting of incidents. So next time you hear a spooky tale about the Bermuda Triangle, remember, science has got your back. Ever wondered how Stonehenge, a prehistoric monument, was built using such massive stones? This monumental mystery has baffled historians, archaeologists, and visitors alike for centuries. Stonehenge, located in the heart of England, is an architectural marvel from the late Stone Age. The mystery lies in the fact that the stones some weighing up to 25 tons were transported over 200 miles. Over the years various theories have been proposed to explain this enigma. Some suggest the Druids were the architects while others believe in the more fantastical notion of extraterrestrial intervention. But how plausible are these theories really? Modern archaeology and engineering have provided more grounded explanations. One such theory is the use of sledges and ropes. It's been suggested that the ancient builders might have dug pathways, filled them with water, and waited for winter. Once the water froze, it would have been easier to slide the massive stones over the ice using sledges. Another theory involves the use of wooden levers and stone balls. The builders could have levered the stones onto a series of stone balls and rolled them to the site. This method, though laborious, is certainly feasible with the tools and knowledge accessible at that time. There's also the theory of manpower and unity. It's estimated that it would have taken around a thousand people to move each stone. This immense collective effort speaks volumes about the community spirit and shared beliefs of the Neolithic people. In the end it's likely that a combination of these methods was used. And while we may never know the exact process, these modern theories offer a glimpse into the ingenuity of our ancestors. So, Stonehenge may not be the work of giants or aliens, but it's still an impressive feat of human ingenuity, don't you think? It's a testament to the remarkable capabilities of mankind, a reminder that sometimes the answers to our greatest mysteries lie not in the stars, but within ourselves. How about the pyramids of Egypt? Were they merely grand tombs or did they serve a higher purpose? Let's delve into the mystery that has bewitched historians, scientists and curious minds alike for centuries. The Pyramids of Egypt, specifically the Great Pyramid of Giza, has been the subject of numerous theories. Some say it was a tomb for pharaohs, while others suggest it was an astronomical tool, a giant telescope of sorts. Intriguing, isn't it? A theory that gained traction was the idea that the pyramids were ancient telescopes. The proponents of this theory argue that the pyramids' shafts, 
align with specific stars, suggesting an astronomical purpose. This, they claim, could have been used for religious rituals, or to track the passage of time. Now let's bring modern science into the picture. With the help of astronomical data, this theory has been largely debunked. Astronomers have pointed out that while the shafts do align with certain stars, this alignment is not precise enough to serve as an effective astronomical tool. Moreover, the pyramid's internal structure doesn't lend itself to stargazing. The narrow winding passages and chambers would have made it impossible to view the stars clearly. The lack of any ancient Egyptian texts referencing the use of the pyramids as telescopes also casts doubt on this theory. So, what were the pyramids really for? Most evidence points to the pyramids being monumental tombs for pharaohs. They were grand structures built to honor and house the remains of the rulers in the afterlife. This aligns with the ancient Egyptians' beliefs about death and the afterlife, lending credibility to this theory. But let's not dismiss the pyramids as mere graves, they are a testament to the incredible engineering abilities of the ancient Egyptians. With their precise measurements and alignments, these structures have stood the test of time, a testament to a civilization's ambition and ingenuity. So, while the pyramids might not have been used to gaze at the stars, they remain a testament to the incredible abilities of the ancient Egyptians. Isn't it fascinating how science has the power to unravel the mysteries of the past? As we've journeyed through some of the world's most perplexing historical enigmas, we've seen the Bermuda Triangle lose its eerie aura, Stonehenge's purpose come to light, and the pyramids of Egypt reveal their celestial secrets. It's almost like we've taken the mystery out of history, isn't it? But remember, there's no need to fear the Bermuda Triangle during your next cruise vacation. Unless, of course, you're afraid of compasses going a little haywire. But hey, at least you won't be abducted by aliens or sucked into a different dimension. Not on our watch. As we wrap up our time-traveling tour, we want to remind you to press the like button if you've enjoyed this journey just as much as we have. And don't forget to subscribe so you won't miss out on our upcoming adventures. We've got a lot more mysteries to solve and trust us, you don't want to miss them. Now that you're armed with this knowledge, why not share it with your friends and family? After all, who doesn't love a good mystery? Until next time, keep exploring, keep learning, and keep questioning. Thanks for watching and don't forget to share this video.